Oh well, I was gonna make a little bee vid here. And this is uh look out, look out big dog. That's the Hogan trap. Here's the numbers on it. There's a picture of the back. That's the part there that bolts against the tree. There's a picture of the box. Hey! No wake! I got a big dog. Alright, so I cut a hole in the back of the box. There's the numbers. That's for the, your B trap if you want one. This does not measure eight and a half inches. This is what it should measure. This is a prototype, so cut me some slack. Anyway, this goes in there. Some frames have, you know, I just threw some of the, the new ones in there for uh, demonstration looking purposes. Here is last year's failed attempt at coming up with a plan. The bees just went right around right around it. Here's the first prototype. That was equally as lame. Oh, okay. So this part, I got these side pieces on right here for where to put a strap against the tree. Fits on like this. This strap to the tree, another strap around there to the same side rails. I'll give you a demonstration tomorrow when it goes in. Here's the best design I've seen for a screen bottom board yet. This one here is courtesy of the Northwestern Indiana Beekeepers. It's made out of two by fours. back up enough I'll give you the numbers <clears throat> it's got a fan slides in and out this right here can either be a piece of uh, insulation or something else there's the numbers on the bottom That's another design of a screen bottom board. Now, uh, and there's another design of a screen bottom board for a nuke. Uh, the thing about the 5 8 hole in the bottom, I uh, hear, I read online where the hole for the B trap was supposed to be uh, 5 16 <coughs> Now, I was going to order that stuff off of. Cali Bees or someone else where they had the, the little cones that you put in here, but they were 70 cents a piece, and that ain't so bad, but the shipping was $15. So what I did is I took a barb uh, half-inch fitting, drilled the hole 5 eighths in the bottom, and it fits right in the hole. I also found something else just around the house. You can use uh, the tip off a cock gun too. Can't hit that hole with an empty net. All right, and that fits in there. Now, the sizes didn't come out exactly, but I noticed that the same size was used for, you know, grafting cup. Fits on there. The thing about the grafting cup, is that just happens to fit right inside that fitting. So if you're looking for the exact measurement you need, stick it in there and cut that off. All right, I'll show you 
how it looks when it's in. Peace. Thanks for watching.